Hello guys, this is kind of exciting because I've got a box and in this box is, this will be the fun moment, hey, like 50 quid's worth of Japanese sweets. <laughs> I've got a selection box from eBay. And they're so cute, out. But I think it's a penguin on this one. It is a penguin. But it's walking like a dog and I got confused. And we've got a cherry squares. So we've bought a lot of sweets and we're going to try them. I think this is baked potato. It's got a baked potato on it, hasn't it? Yeah. Oh, it's because it's is... crisps. Yeah. <laughs> Salty butter potato flavoured crisps. This one has it written on it, buying and good. What? Buying and good. I do love when you get sort of English words in Japanese stuff. I think it's fantastic. This looks pretty cute. Potato stick, this is mostly air. There's a lot of air in this bag. Chewy fruit candy. It's quite good. I'm trying to sort of like all try. We can we can try a bit each. And just, are you trying to group them up? Oh, yeah, there's a few things that are exactly the same. Yeah, yeah. I'm trying to sort of like at least. Oh, that's cute. Oh, I dropped it. Yeah, I'm just trying to sort of like turn stuff around. So you can have. Can you eat that? It's like marshmallow. We just got Winnie the poop on it. That looks fancy. It looks like it's like pretend diamonds. It's one of those ones that you like kind of make. Yeah. So we need oh, to have a tail. Tail. It's a bit strange. That is strange. Is it good? Is it marshmallow? Yeah. Ah. It's really sweet and strawberry. Oh, it's like a. Oh, the strawberry, strawberry is like strawberry, strawberry cream in the middle. Ah. Right. What are you going to try? Well, I, I need to sort of separate what you can eat because um, I don't want to just sort of... Okay, so I know going by this what I can't eat. Oh, shit, check out the Kit Kats. They're mine, aren't they? You can't eat Kit Kats. Yeah, no, I can't. Hey, I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten different Kit Kats. I've had to go through and look at what I can't, can and can't eat because I've got seen it with these. So there's certain things that um, I won't be able to eat that contain wheat or barley. Ah! Oh. <laughs> Super thin and tasty appetising biscuit. Oh, look, I've got an Easter Kit Kat. That's actually really cute. <laughs> so we know I can't eat the Kit Kats, okay? Right, I can't Kit eat. Kit Kats are mine. The mi You've I just ruined eat. my organisation, haven't you? I turned everything over. Can you have the key? Yeah. Can't have that. Yes, I wanted that. I can't have that that panda thing you picked up. What panda thing the I picked melon up? The melon. Oh, that you this. Could Panda row. Yeah, I can't eat that. Ah, I wanted that too. Ah. Okay, that's really random. I can't eat. I don't think that. you can. I don't think you can eat these because these feel like. Oh no, I can eat those. They've got corn. corn. Those are corn. Um, well, I've got three good. of them, so that's something different. I think. Can you eat that? This is Doraemon as well. Yeah. Well, that's cool. We can split them. No, no, I can't. Those are the ones I can't eat. Okay, I'll have that. You pick two of these. White, yellow, orange. What do you want? That. What do you want? Pick two. Um, I'm guessing they're different flavours, maybe? I don't know. Okay. I said pick two. Right, these two. That's just got a picture of bacon on it. It looks so <laughs> nice. <laughs> I wonder if it's like um, pork scratchings, maybe. But basically, it just looks like a, a wafer that you get with an ice cream sandwich. <laughs> with a picture of bacon on it. It literally does look like that, doesn't it? Right, so you can eat all of this stuff? I think so. That, um, this. What is this? Oh, I can eat that. Wait, can I eat these? Ah! <laughs> Sorry, I'm probably making things difficult, aren't I? Oh, I can eat those. Yeah, I can eat all this. Cool. Yeah. Okay. Well, we can start munching. Now that that's decided. I just need to remember that my pile is here. Your, your separate not here. pile. I might just sort of go, oh, these look nice. What is it? I was looking for that, but it's tiny. I thought it would be bigger than that. What, oh, chocolate. Yeah. Bis. 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 It's basically like a biscuit. Like a little mini biscuit. I'll start with the smallest one then. Bis. Okay. This is... Oh, it's broken! I'll just say what it is in case people want to try it. Alright, I'm just had the subtle crunch. <laughs> Are you eating that? 
Sakura, Sakurambo Moki, cherry flavoured candy made from rice cake. This looks pretty damn cute. That was pretty good. Chalky biscuit. Let's try it. It's just like a standard biscuit whiskey. That's quite fancy that it's in a container. I don't understand why it's squared though. So it's like 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 rice cake. It is just mocky, actually. Ah. Uh, and little squares. Oh, I'm trying it's to get into my bacon. Very Ugh. subtle cherry flavour. It's sticky. Very creamy. What is that? <laughs> I just threw a picture of bacon on the front and I was like... It's really, st like, sticky. You feel it? Oh, yeah. It feels like leather. <laughs> it seems like it's a bit leather textured as well. I can't chew it. I can't get into it. I don't know what it is. I don't even know if I like it. Okay, this, what you're eating. <laughs> Sorry, it's not that weird. Okay. Um, is Calvi Taro made from minced fish, boneless, short rib flavour. I don't think it tastes like that. Is that minced? How can it be minced fish but rib flavoured? That, there's something weird about that to me. Yeah. And then there's a, the picture on the front is looks like... It looks like steak. It looks like steak. <laughs> picture looks like steak. <laughs> Apparently it tastes like ribs made out of fish. There you go. You have to use a little thing. I'm not going to put it in my mouth though because obviously I'm eating gluten today. Yeah. Okay then, yeah. Oh, do you not want any more? No. No. Oh. You can share them. Oh. No. You know what you think. I'm not sharing mine. <laughs> Actually, not that is cherry flavoured. Yeah, you could do a bit more cherry. It's yeah, it's subtle, isn't it's it? A subtle taste. It's not very overpowering. Powering, but quite a lot of Japan food is sort of subtle. Whereas, because like if I buy like almost like a squash juice type drink in Japan, it's very very mild compared yeah. to what we have in the UK, where it's incredibly strong. No, I, th I agree. I feel a lot healthier when I eat Japanese food. <laughs> I'm going to try these. Like that chocolate pancakes. Yeah, they, are. they look like pancakes. Yeah. It's like I've got six minutes of pancakes in here. It's quite cute. Oh, sorry, I lied. It's not six, it's four. Oh, oh that's clever. It's basically just like a pancake sandwich with chocolate in the middle. Oh, that's quite clever. Oh, they're nice. Mmm. These are really good. Pancakes are a little bit overdone. Okay. Oh, for me, I have um, like very mildly cooked pancakes. Mm. Whereas if you have what I'm going to call normally cooked pancakes, it's probably fine. Oh, oh this is really strange. What is it? These taste like um, they're like very thin, wafery biscuits, but they, when you eat it, it's like having a mouthful of butter. It's like. What? As in like it melt, melts in your mouth? I think it tastes like butter. It tastes like, like butter? And a little bit like a jacket potato. Really, really weird. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Mm. It's like you've just eaten butter. <laughs> I like it though. Mmm. It's like slightly salty. It's really good. Mmm. I'm struggling to get into food at the minute. You can make a good ASMR video with these kind of things. I sm did not smell like I expected. They look like those mini cheddars, but they don't smell like them. They do look like mini cheddars. They taste alright. I'm going to try this melon biscuit, which I thought would be a, a cheese biscuit. Oh, they don't have cheese in Japan. That's something I'm going to miss if I move out there. They don't have cheese in Japan. They don't do cheese. That's not really a thing, that. Oh, this is like a snacker jack rice cake. Hmm. I don't think it tastes like melon, though. Snacker jack! These are really out of date. <laughs> are they? <laughs> oh. 
three three years that date. Oh wow! Oh, oh okay. no, actually that's his. Are these Japanese dates? Might Was be. it twenty one? Yeah, they're in 2019. I've seen the two of 21, I was like, that's a bit different. Goes mm. off in 2021. I tried a bit of the cola one, I'm going to try a bit of the grape one. It just tastes like gummy candy. The grape one's a bit of a strange colour. It is. I just like kind of stuck in my mouth. I like the kind of chewy um, texture. Sweets that we have here like this, but more subtle. Porkery. So I okay. think this is like pocky, but not pocky. Yeah, that's another. Oh no, it's, yeah, pretzel barbecue flavored. Oh, porkery! That is such a cool name. Porkery. Porkery. Oh, it doesn't quite come like pocky does. Oh, it's just like little miniature breadsticks. Oh, I like the happy fruit that's on there. We've got an onion, a pepper. Got smiling faces. Really <laughs> it's got a little bit of spice to it. That was unexpected. <laughs> mm. Is that like? <clears throat> I think it's like popping candy. Oh, I thought it was like Kool Aid. It says cola popping candies oh. filled mixed with Ramoon fizzy tablets. They start to fizz as soon as they dissolve in one's mouth. <laughs> That's what it says. I thought it was going to be like, well, Kool Aid, what you mix with water, you have to I'm going to have this strawberry Tootsie Roll thingy. Is that soup flavoured? Is that not nice? Flavor. Don't know. Let's try. I don't know, but it does. It tastes. It does taste like a sort of slightly, slightly herby soup, but I do not like the taste of it. Might be more to your taste. It's it's weird because I put it in and like the instant taste I got, I was it's like, fish. oh, that's really nice. <laughs> and then as I kept chewing, I was just like, the taste is changing. Mmm, and now it's left a really it's funny taste in my mouth. It's not bad. I mean, I will eat it, but I've got it was very it's, unexpected. I think this one might be a bit hot because there's like a little bird on the front sweating, holding two chilies. <laughs> Isn't he holding a chili and a prawn? Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's very um. Oh uh, no, my Tootsie style got roll has got a bit squashed as well. <laughs> no, it's quite hard to pop. Pop the cherry. <laughs> oh, I think your little Tootsie roll. Mm. I bet it's nice. Mm. Let me store bully. Let's go this way, I'm afraid. Well, the air that just escaped that when I opened it. <laughs> oh, that's very prawny. I'd be like a spice, uh, spicy, a spicy prawn. No good? That is so spicy. <laughs> oh my god, and I like spicy food. I love spicy food. Oh, I dare you. I dare, double dare you on camera to put a handful in your mouth. Oh, I <laughs> Do your challenge of a small handful. <laughs> Mostly because I've got a little mouth. You've got a little mouth. Alright, let's give this a go. What's the betting I'll drink um, like Rockstar to try and get rid of the spice, which makes it worse. No! <laughs> Stop foaming at the mouth. Alright. Oh, this is weird. No, do you like it? It does. It's like it, it is like very spicy porn. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I had one of them last night. It's quite amusing. Oh, that was really anticlimactic. Because I was expecting like my head to blow off, but I've just got a little tingle. <laughs> this is like um from the anime um Doraemon or however you say it, and it is essentially like this one is cheese flavour, and it's essentially a giant what's it. So that's exactly the best way to describe the taste. Mm. I think the only thing that's sort of off putting is it's just like proper tube shaped. Mm. There's a hole through the middle of it. <laughs> I had one of those last night, and what it reminded me of is the um, Transformer sweets. You know, the 20p ones where you've got like the guy that's like that and you can put the wheels on? It reminded mm. me of that because I had a like, barbecue beefy flavoured one. 
I'm gonna eat my one because I think I've got a different flavour. What's the better that this is like chili flavoured? I think it yakitori. is. Yakitori. Yakitori. I don't know what yakitori is, do you? <laughs> yeah. It's all right. The one I had yesterday was better. All right. What was it? Barbecue beef. That's quite cute. Little cake flavoured chocolate. Chocolate shaped like a little cake slice. Cake flavoured chocolate? Yeah. I'll try yeah. most of this stuff. What's this? Blueberry ramoon. Um. I like ramoon. My favourite is the original flavour though. Look at that. I'm going to eat the panda. Hmm. They're nice. Try them, Charlie. Oops. <laughs> I got I got quite a lot here. I'm gonna try one. Very blueberry. Yeah, very blueberry. Mm. I can confirm that that chocolate didn't taste like cake. That's what confused me. I don't know how you're gonna get cake flavor. No. It tasted like my panda! Oh, that's really sad. He's lost half of his face. Panda! Because this one actually does have like a hint of a melony mangoey taste. Looks a bit green. This is um bottled powder ramoon candy. It tastes it doesn't really taste of anything. It tastes more just sherbet y. I thought it was sherbet. Mm. What is this? Oh. oh. Okay, you're supposed to do stuff with it. It looks like you're supposed to put soy sauce on it. What? Look at the back on the little diagram. It's a milk cracker though, so it can't be. Milk cracker. I think you're supposed Unless to... it's just like a general flavouring thing, because yeah. it makes no it, sense. It has so an ice cream on the back, so probably... You probably put them in as wafer, use them as wafers, yeah, maybe. maybe. Well, if you want soy sauce, I do have soy sauce in the box. Right. These things, they look like... Yeah, they look very much like um, wafers that you put in ice creams. I've got numerous bowls now. I feel very light. But yeah, I can confirm. These are like ice cream wafers. They taste almost exactly like the, cork cup, the um, cones that you get. Mmm. Mmm. Thank you. Just the ice cream cone. Mm. Mm. It's a very thin wafer. These are really good. Are they? Mm. They're like perfetta rolls just without the cream. Oh, yeah. Mm. This is like a little. Look at these water, aren't you? I'm not sure. Possibly. Oh, it's got a little. You see the little man? <laughs> the little man? Ah! Bollocks. Yeah, you're going to need water. Can't substitute it for monster, can I? <laughs> okay. Alright, well, while you're doing that, I'm going to eat my fish. I know it's not actually called it a fish. It looks really nice, that one. What is it called? It's called an actual thing. Okay. I'm cheating. It is the big one. Purple. Doesn't even say on that. Either way, I'm eating the fish. Can you add that to it. Okay. Easy. Yeah. That shows all actually. Oh look, my fish stayed intact. Sorry. Oh well. Oh, that's cute. The thing that's annoying is I like, have it that way. And then turn it around and it's <laughs> upside down. <laughs> so you, you literally have to sort of like flip the fish. But it looks good, it looks like it's got chocolate in the middle. Everywhere. That is a lot of chocolate. Oh wow. <laughs> no, it's proper ram. <laughs> is it like Nutella at your? No. It's like aero bubble chocolate. Okay. 
Wow, that is quite good. Not like the British standards of let's fill the bag halfway. Let's like proper ram yeah, it all really in. Not. It would be me with that bag. No. It looks quite runny. It is. Um, you add red one. Green one. It should be a red one. Yeah. <coughs> I feel like that was just sugar. I feel like that's pure sugar in that in that packaging. <laughs> oh! Oh, it's changed the colour. Look at that. Oh! That's, that's really cute. cute. I don't know if you can see, but it's turned the blue like a pastel pastel purple. Oh, that is so freaking cute. A lilac. And it's really gloopy. And then these are the little things that you. This is really cute. It's like jewels. It comes with like edible crystals. And they're actually like. Look. Aww. It's like right up my alley, this is. I thought it would be. Oh, milk coffee. <laughs> One of the ones I've got in here, I thought it was coffee. It's milk coffee covered barley pups. <laughs> you can eat it as cereal too. Would you like some? No, I'm alright. I don't want it. It's too gay for me. It's pretty gay. <laughs> it's a pretty gay snack. Mm. Maybe good for pride. With the many variety of Kit Kats I've got. I don't think they're actually on the list of stuff that I've got. No, I don't think so. There's a few things that I couldn't find on the list. Those Kit Kats. What flavour Kit Kats did you get? The dark one that's on here I ate last night. Hmm. Because that was just a loose one, but I've got all of these. Let's see. That looks like cherry and almond. That's probably original. That's Easter. Oh, that's original. This is really cute, this Easter one. This is mint. It's got like a little message, a bit on the back. You can put a message. Oh, I don't... Okay, that's light green. That's dark green. Ooh. This is black. You have to see what... This might be ice cream. Oh, the black one. And this one's pink. I wonder what the um, dark green one would be. Oh, the dark green one's probably mint because it's got like a mint leaf on it. Yeah, but it. so it's a light green. Oh, yeah. So that's why I'm now calling it light green. Well, maybe one is dark chocolate. Maybe. But even so, let's do this green thing. Oh, yeah, that's not on there. Don't know what it is. <laughs> it's an utter surprise. It's an utter surprise. Even to us. It's a biscuit. It's green. It might be another melon one. Possibly. Or matcha. Oh, biscuit. Hmm. It's melon. It is melon. It's a key. <laughs> it keeps <If> wobbling. <laughs> now all I'm thinking of is, if there's a key, then there has to be a lock. <laughs> <laughs> That's luck. There have to be a lot. Shut These up! These are like basically Smarties because they're exactly the same as Smarties. Oh, are they? Yeah, you try them. They're exactly the same. It's like a rip off a slime. Mm. Unless those come first, in which case, bad Nestle. Well, they are good, that much. <laughs> Now that this is out, I'm sort of here just going, I got the key, I got the secret. They're a bit more flavourful than Smarties, because Smarties are just sort of, like your basic. But although I've just had a melon cookie, so it could be I've eaten the green one, and tasting the melon from the cookie, yeah. and thinking it's more flavourful. Maybe. This is quite cute. 
cute. Comes in an actual little wafer uh, basket. These are crispy noodles. Ooh. I'm loving the animation on it. I know someone that eats noodles like dry. Dry. I eat noodles dry. Do you? Not all the time, but I have eaten noodles dry. Oh, I like these. I'm trying to figure out the flavour though. Mm. I'm trying to figure out the flavour of these. See, I can't tell if this is beef or chicken. Unless it's like a barbecue chicken flavour. Because it doesn't taste like our chicken noodles. No. But in Japan, they sort of like mix different stuff together. Oh, right, yeah, yeah. So I went to Comic Con and I bought the ramen and it turned out to be chicken and fish. Oh yeah. So yeah. I, I wouldn't have thought it would go together. <laughs> we thought it was just chicken, didn't we? We thought it was chicken. Uh, That's uh, just like they, what they've done is they put like cola popping candy and then shove some of those removed, <laughs> like these basically yeah. on top. You could probably shove the rest of those in with it, couldn't you? I can hear that. That's really, really poppy. <laughs> I'm just such a child. Right, I'm gonna have my milk coffee that can be used for cereal. Japan has better popping candy than us. I've come to that, definitely come to that conclusion. This is real popping candy. It makes ours makes ours look weak. <laughs> oh, my coffee puffs. Oh yeah, those are the things that it said like. Oh my god, they look like sugar puffs. Really, really powerful. <laughs> Let's try a little bit. You have the rest. Yeah. I don't it's know good. if you can eat them. I can't. These are like. Are they are sugar puffs. Yeah, they're a lot like sugar puffs. They like. They don't taste like sugar. I mean, I don't like sugar puffs, but I like those. It made me laugh because you can eat as a cereal too. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just trying to get the flavour of this. Oh, oh. Yeah, none of our popping candy does that, does it? <laughs> I can feel it on the top of my mouth. Mm. It's big. I love it. Well, <laughs> we all know that. Oh, fuck, it's over my tongue. <laughs> oh my god, I want a sugar heart. What plane's going over today? Hmm. We're near Shuttleworth Airfield. I think they've got a show on this weekend. <clears throat> the popping was in my brain. Every now and again, I'll just get a random pop, but I'm still getting them. Yeah. The thing is, the annoying thing is, because now the popping can is sort of stuck at the back of my jaw, it's like right connected to my ears. <laughs> I'm going to attempt to try the many various Kit Kats. Um. That one just looks like a normal one, so does that one. I am going to start off with the dark green, which we thought was mint. I wonder what that was then, it's your chart mind, the onesie. <laughs> I still think that's mega cute. This feels a little bit exciting, unnerving when you get a Kit Kat that's green. Ooh, I'd be so excited. Was it smell like? No. It smells like, it smells like um, matcha, like green tea, like the flavour I like. It might be green tea actually. It's, it, that's what it smells like, but I could be wrong. Like the flavour of... Um, matcha. Oh, I'm so jealous. The flavour of my frappuccinos that I like. Mm. Yeah. Double a good frappuccino. When we go to Japan, I'm going to get matcha everything. Oh, the frappuccino. Where's my fucking frappuccino? Here's another one of those blue tongue candies. Oh, that's not the one I had. No. No, this one actually has a picture of a blue tongue on it, so you think it's going to turn my tongue blue. Oh, it's just going by. There's no one who's chewing gum on here. It doesn't taste all that great. The, flavor, the tongue flavouring ones normally don't. Uh, let's do the light green. I'm worried that it might be wasabi. Oh, yeah. Because that might be a thing. 
I think it could be a thing in Japan. It is a thing in Japan. That's not the same as the other one. Mm. I don't really eat wasabi, so I don't know what it tastes, um, it smells like even. It's very spicy, isn't it? Mm. No, this isn't. I don't know what it is. It's gross. I'm entertained. <laughs> Blue tongue. No, I don't know what flavour this is. At all. I think it's... Like, it tastes almost exactly the same as the dark green one. Right, so this is pink. Looks like a pink wafer. It's pretty damn gay. Yeah, very gay. Suit you. <laughs> this is strawberries and cream. Right, I'm going to do the one that looks like it's got ice cream on it. Oh, it's cream! Ugh! Ice cream. Oh, it looks like it could be a raspberry ripple type ice cream. Raspberry ripple. Ooh, that does look really nice, actually. Mm. Oh, pin the needle, pin the needle, pin the needle. Panic over. What were you panicking about? Yeah, like you, saying you got pin the needles. Oh. What's up? I'm surrounded by sweets. What's that to panic about? Mm, I'm sugar high. Mm. I'm not. Because there's not many of the savoury stuff I could eat, it's like I'm just eating all the sweet stuff, so it's like <laughs> whoosh straight to my head. No, it's Easter, Easter, Easter one. What's this flavour? Pizza? Cheese? Chilli? Um, beef tongue, apparently. That's the one I had the other day. Oh, well, maybe, maybe I didn't have the beef one. No, you've got that. Oh. Yakitori. Yakitori. Oh, I can't get into Easter. It's white. What's white at Easter? That's not very nice. I don't need it then. Tastes like beef. <laughs> <laughs> no, it doesn't. Do you want it back? <laughs> no, I don't like it, but it doesn't taste like beef. It's very funny when you first eat something and then you get a taste later. I think it's some kind of um, fish. <laughs> that, was, that was very <laughs> dramatic, wasn't it? Mm. My Easter Kit Kat. My Easter Kit Kat tastes like banana. I don't okay. see don't see the reference between banana and Easter. You're like, what's white in Easter? And all I could think of was bunny rabbits. <laughs> it's bunny flavored. <laughs> Who'd have thought bunnies tasted like banana? Right. Black one! My oh, apologies, I'm just looking up what yakitori is. Because I really think it's fish. Probably is fish. Good thing I'm not actually allergic to fish. Ah, it's dark chocolate. Oh, no, it's chicken. Ah! It's chicken. It's this type of skewered chicken. That was. I, don't I reckon you'd like that. I probably would, but I can't be honest. It just, it just looks like. Oh, it looks like chicken and kebab there. Yeah, kebab. That was kebab. I wasn't going to eat it as a chicken kebab. Shish kebab. Oh, that was dark chocolate. Now, I'm normally fine with dark chocolate, but that was really insanely dark chocolate. Oh my god, that was really dark. This is like mocky, and it's coming a little way for. Oh, what a basket. Can I have one of the green ones? You can eat it. have a mangy for sharing. I'm not. At first, because this comes in a red packet, I thought it was a normal Kit Kat, but it's very, very pink. I don't think it's a normal Kit Kat anymore. No. This one might be. This one's just strawberry. No cream in it. It's a bit sad. Plain strawberry. Yeah, but it's really, really powerful. To be honest, I'd be really disappointed if you bought a Japanese um, selection box and got a normal English Kit Kat. <laughs> yeah. Right, I could have gone to Astro and got that. There's one that I think is cherry and almond. Hmm. Based on the picture. Oh, it's in dark chocolate. Cherry. Oh, but look at that. Cherry goes good with dark chocolate. That's it, cute. It got, oh, it's melting. It's got, like, stuff. Floating on the top. Just saying that it's not really a Kit Kat because there's only one one line. Stick. The whole thing about a Kit Kat is you break it. Mm. 
have a break. Have a Kit Kat. So what is that like? Have a stick. <laughs> it just doesn't work, does it? <laughs> a little while ago we were going on about how some of their flavours seem just like hints of flavours. Mm. The last like few Kit Kats I've had have been extremely overpowering with yeah. flavour. Like I had the this one, the strawberry one and the dark chocolate one. All oh, of sure. them have made me a bit like sort of twitchy. I mean this is a really good deal. I really liked so my I really liked the popping candy and I really liked the like crisps that were like the wafery type crisps that mm. were like butter like had a jack of potato on the front. I really they liked were nice. They were really nice. Really nice. But if you wanted to have to get any of this, it's from eBay. eBay. <laughs> Sushi candy. Selection box. But yeah, I cannot remember how much it cost me, but because it came from Japan, you did have I did have to wait a while for delivery. But I'm really sat satisfied. It's really box. good. Oh uh, yeah, it's really worth it, isn't it? Yeah. I think we'll be doing this again because apparently they do a different selection each month as well. A lot of that stuff was really nice. I really like the melon biscuits. I don't think I Did would, you? but the melon biscuits were really nice. They're good. Mm. And I think the panda was mango, which was really nice. It's really good. Just like really. I really like the little cherry mocky. Yeah, <laughs> that's good. They were the ones where I said could do with a bit more flavouring because they were only really hinting at it. Mm. I liked it. I liked the fact it was subtle. I enjoyed that. Right, that was we've, good. we've had a lot of sugar. <laughs> I think we now need to have sushi to sort of counteract. Yeah, we'll go get some sushi. Okay. <laughs> Bye! Bye.